this episode of Federal Fall, I'm going to take you on the most scenic bike trail in all of the Palm Beaches, and we're getting started right now. I'm Palm Beaches Paul, your local realtor and guide to the Palm Beaches, and welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, please, please, please hit that subscribe button, and if you hit the little bell, you'll get notified each time I make a new video. Sometimes it can be about buying or selling real estate, other times it's just about getting out and exploring the beautiful Palm Beaches, just like we're doing today. So today I have a special edition for you. I'm coming from the beautiful island of Palm Beach and I'm over on the lake trail. Now, it's June, which means it's almost summer here in Florida, and that means getting out and doing all sorts of great outdoor activities, including bike riding. And I happen to be on one of the most scenic bike trails in all of Palm Beach County. The lake bike trail is about five miles long, and it runs along the intercoastal waterway. And on one side, you have beautiful water and the scenic downtown West Palm Beach and all these magnificent boats. And on the other side, you have these beautiful mansions, some of them historic, like the one we saw at the beginning of the video, which is the oldest remaining house on the island of Palm Beach. But what makes today's video even more special is you're not just getting one YouTuber, you're getting three. So in today's video, I have Troy and Andrea of Troy and Andrea's Little Adventures, who are some very good and long friends of mine. I met Troy about, oh, 27 years ago when we were both uh, copier salesman, yes, we were those guys. All right, Xerox repairman, the guy who checks the toner, the toner checker man. Hey, I'm trying to work here. The guys who sold copiers. And, uh, you know, he went on his path of becoming a musician and then a minister, and they lived in Paraguay. I became uh, a salesman and then a realtor. Um, but here we are, 28 years later, and we both have YouTube channels, and we also like to ride our bikes. So their channel is all about bike riding through Florida and going on adventures. And of course, you know what my channel is about. So let me introduce you to Troy and Andrea. All right. So as I said, I'm riding with some of my good friends, Troy and Andrea of Our Little Adventures. That's right. Troy and Andrea's Little, Little Adventures. adventures. Yes. This is Andrea. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> this is my buddy, Troy. Hey, good to see y'all. And uh, they, uh, where, where about in Florida do y'all live now? It's um, We live in Pensacola, just outside of Pensacola. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, and as I said, Troy and I knew each other from way back. We used to work together and then met Andrea. And, uh, and then they went their ways and I went my ways. But here we are together and, uh, you know, we're, we're doing videos on YouTube. So um, your, your channel is all about getting on bikes. You guys like to go bike riding and going yes. through little adventures. So little adventures through Florida. Yeah, so yeah. all of our life has been a one big adventure, it seems like. So we lived in South America. We've been over to Europe and then all around the United States. And so we now like riding bikes as our favorite pastime. And so we discovered the rails to trails. And so it's kind of become our quest to go and, and explore all the trails. So little adventures. Yeah, so we hike, we bike, we have foodie adventures and just check out local things to do in the area. That's pretty awesome. Um, <laughs> there's so much to see in Florida. You know, you, you know that you see me doing a lot of Palm Beach County and stuff. They're going all over the state, which is exciting. And uh, so maybe what we'll do is uh, sometime in the future, uh, my wife, Angie, we're going to get her in video eventually. Um, we'll come up to your neck of the woods oh, yes. and we'll do up there. Absolutely. But we got this great adventure to go on today. It's a beautiful trail. It's a beautiful day in uh, the Palm Beaches. So let's get out and enjoy paradise together. Let's go. When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun. Side by side, our fears are done. Now 
the bike trail is, uh, or the lake trail, as it's called, is located on the island of Palm Beach, like I said, which is just across the intercoastal. See the intercoastal? That over there is beautiful West Palm Beach. I made a video about that. You can check that out in the link at the end of this video. But uh, it's just across the bridge. And um, like I said, it's about a five and a half mile bike trail. Uh, it's, it's a really just scenic, beautiful trail, easy to ride. Um, you know, lots of shade. You have all these beautiful trees. And uh, of course, the breeze from the being right here by the water. And the island of Palm Beach itself is absolutely beautiful. I do plan to do uh, another video about the uh, town of Palm Beach and uh, we'll try to work on that sometime this summer. Um, there's a lot of history over here, like Flagler Mansion that you saw at the very beginning of the video, um, and the old house at the beginning. So uh, they've done a great job of keeping a lot of the historical value uh, here in this uh, island of the rich and famous. So, but uh, anyway. So we're just cruising along, and um, it's just, it's one of my favorite things to do. Uh, when I always say, get out and enjoy paradise, I think you can see why. This is it right here. Now, I wouldn't be a realtor if I didn't throw in just a little bit of salesy stuff. See across the way, there's some beautiful condos being built. And uh, if living in downtown West Palm Beach with a view of the beautiful intercoastal, and of course, Flagler Mansion, that's it right there, that big white house. Um, if you're interested, let me know. We have some new condos being built over there, and I'll be happy to uh, get you some information about that. But uh, let's go back to why we're here, the beautiful bike trail. <laughs> So right now we're passing by Point Santa Plaza. Hey Troy. Hey. You know what used to be right here in this exact spot? No, actually I don't. The world's largest wooden structure. Really? At one time, the world's largest wooden hotel was built oh. right here okay. and is right next to uh, uh, Flagler owned that as well. It was called the Point Siena, um, but unfortunately it burnt down. I was going to say, since you said wood. Yeah, wood, <laughs> yeah. It burnt down, but uh, it was massive. So, as I said, there's a lot of history here in the, uh, on the island of Palm Beach. Um, Henry Morrison Flagler, who developed the, East, the Florida East Coast Railroad, pretty much uh, invented snowbird vacation because he created uh, the railroad, which brought all the snowbirds down, and then he built the Breakers Hotel, um, which is another famous landmark. And uh, so everybody started to come down here and vacation and stay to get out of the cold winter. And then they ended up uh, deciding to build homes down here. So a lot of history, really neat city. Biltmore. It's now a condo building, but it was also a hotel at one time. And uh, I just look at the architecture. Absolutely stunning. So we went underneath the bridge, and we're on the other side of the trail. And on this side, as you can see, there's a little bit more residential. So um, we've got obviously all the boat docks here where uh, people, you know, park their boats. Um, a lot of people obviously come here for the winter. Uh, Palm Beach is known for that. And then they go back up to the northeast, wherever they're from. But uh, so you can see, I'm passing some really beautiful condos, and um, they have quite a few of those. And then we're gonna get a little further down here. You'll start to see some of the single-family homes. Now they have these big hedges for privacy, and you can't blame them. But you'll get a glimpse of them. But just magnificent homes. Some of them built in the early 1920s. Some of them more modern. But uh, you know, what a view, right? Wake up, have your cup of coffee, come out and see this and the beach is only a five minute bike ride so uh yeah, you're close to everything this is this is true paradise over here so you see all the hedges which is you know nice and private i mean i wouldn't want someone riding their bike looking at my backyard every day but um it's, it's really pretty even the hedges are beautiful and the little walkways and the walkways it's just a scenic scenic bike trail
decided to stop right here. It's probably one of the most scenic stops on the bike trail. We're in front of the old Bethesda by the Sea Church. Um, beautiful private residence now. Troy was going to go walk inside. <laughs> he owns the he place. He stopped me. <laughs> I would have gone. But uh, it's just, a, it's, I mean, beautiful. This clock tower, just a really neat place, all the foliage. And uh, it's interesting. It was uh, it was built in 1860. Yeah, 1864 or something. Or, like and that, the last yeah. service was Easter uh, 1925. So pretty neat. But just part of that history you can find along the bike trail here. But uh, speaking of history, this guy and I go way back. So a little bit, you know, we're a couple old Texas boys. Yes. So I grew up in San Antonio, Texas, and you were in... I grew up in Fort Worth, just outside of Fort Worth, Texas. Yeah, so, and then we met, so we hit it off immediately. And uh, But being from Texas, we both like country music, but we also love the salt water and the salt life. So we right. came up with the term, and this is our term trademarked. The Coconut, Coconut Cowboys. Cowboys. <laughs> That's right. So we like country music and flip flops. And don't forget barbecue. We and still barbecue. love our barbecue and, and our Tex Mex. Yep, and Tex Mex. In fact, and, that was one of the quests that we had was just trying to find good Tex Mex down here. And we yeah. finally we finally got some we down did, here in yeah. the Palm Beaches. So. It's a little hard when you're in the southeast Florida. There, it's here, but it didn't like in Texas and stuff. And, uh, and of course, I would say the sweet iced tea. Yes. But uh, the wife cut me off on that. She's trying to help me <laughs> shed a few. And, and it's helped. I've lost a few. So now I'm drinking iced tea with not real sweetener so but uh but so what you know you guys have a fun channel um i love making videos like i'm sure you guys do and trying to show people what it's like where do you guys where do you want to go with your channel what do you want where do you, what plans do you guys have and what adventures well we have a bunch of adventures and and that is uh traveling in places in the united states we're going to be going up to west virginia hopefully in the fall we have a trip planned to israel and also to rome Wow. And you'll see some other places in Italy as well. As well. And uh, just keep And Now, we served as missionaries in Paraguay, South America. So we'll be going back to South America and probably make a few stops down there. And so we're all about just travel and adventure. And everything's an adventure for us. Even if it's just going to a, we went to a local barbecue place. Yeah. And that was an adventure. So everything's an adventure. Life is an adventure, Paul. It, 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 it <laughs> definitely is an adventure. Now, are you guys going to take your bikes with you? Probably not when we go overseas. Yeah. Uh, yeah. When we go overseas, we probably won't. That'll be a different one. But we just got into biking about a year ago, right when COVID hit. Right. Uh, it gave us an opportunity to get out and get some exercise. Yeah. And we just fell in love with it. Yeah. And then we discovered what's called rails to trails. And there's trails all over America. And so we just started going around to these different trails that and riding cool. them. And we just recently did one. And Andrea rode 40 miles. Yeah. Wow. And yeah. so, yeah. And one of my things that I love doing, since I am from South Florida, we do not have a change of seasons. So we had this quest all fall to find fall leaves. So that was amazing to me because I'm not used to that. So that's what the West Virginia trip coming up is about. Is uh, We, we uh, found some beautiful fall leaves up there. There's a beautiful trail. We'll do that. But the other cool thing is we live in the Panhandle. So we're just 20 minutes from Alabama, not very far from Mississippi and Louisiana. So there's a bunch of trails in there that uh, we'll be riding this summer and in the fall. Uh, yeah, I'm jealous. So if it, it shows my face of jealous because, I, you know, I, the, I love the Palm Beaches, and I'll show you guys all about the Palm Beaches, but at some point I may have to expand out of Palm Beach County and go explore a couple other places doing some pedaling with Paul. I love what they're doing. I, it's great to be with you guys again. It's great and to be it's with so you, Paul. It's funny that we ended up making videos and <laughs> getting to enjoy the same things in life. So, but, uh, all right, so we got a little bit more of this trail left. We're going to head down a little bit more and then head back so I don't get a parking ticket. Yeah. This happened the last time I made a video here, so um, but it wasn't. It's not raining this time, so it's yeah. beautiful. So a few more spots, and then and we may go try and find a bite to eat somewhere nearby. So uh, you ready? To keep pedaling a little bit more. You bet. Yeah. All right, let's go. Now don't forget, this is a dual YouTube video, meaning I'm making my video and Troy and Andrea are making theirs. So at the end of my video, not only can you go to their channel and, and subscribe, check it out, but I'll have a link for their video from our day trip and uh, vice versa, they'll have a link to mine and then that way you guys can uh, look at the two channels and, and get twice the fun, right? Twice the fun. Twice. twice. Half the price. Exactly. <laughs> and we are old top your salesman. <laughs> also, beautiful boats. Lots of beautiful boats. right here when I reach 10 million subscribers is where I'm gonna put Palm Beach's Paul new mansion
You hear Troy laughing? Yeah. <laughs> Keep dreaming, buddy. beautiful day in paradise couldn't ask for a more perfect Friday with two of my best old friends and beautiful backdrop of Palm Beach the lake trail and it's just paradise I tell you I say it all the time because I mean it it is a beautiful place uh, had a great time riding with Troy and Andrea you guys are great they have an awesome Enjoy channel it, yeah this is fun this is uh, this is what you're supposed to do get out and enjoy life and enjoy good times with good friends and uh, so be sure to subscribe to their channel I'll be sure to put a link at the end of this video so you can do that they got all sorts of cool adventures coming up so be sure to subscribe and follow them um, just really great people and a really fun YouTube channel and uh, and uh, I have some more videos coming up as well I've got some more adventures to do um, as I mentioned earlier I just bought a kayak so you're gonna see Palm Beach's fall getting out on the water love that get out there and do a little uh, kayaking and showing you what it's like from the water. It's a great way to enjoy living in South Florida. But uh, we're going to go get a bite to eat and uh, wrap this day up. So, as always, when you're in the Palm Beaches or on little adventures, get out and enjoy paradise. I'll talk to you next week. <laughs>